battery kill. Welcome everyone, I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today I've got a special video to bring you. I noticed a couple of days ago I was going to reach 500 subscribers and I wanted to create a special video for everyone that watches my videos and subscribes to my channel just to mark the occasion of reaching 500 subscribers and say a little thank you. So I thought what's something I could do that's a little bit special, something a little bit difficult and I thought why not try and get a nuked out in Black Ops 3. So that is the gameplay you're watching at the moment. Now I've already got a nuclear and a nuked out gameplay on my channel channel, they were both an Xbox One. For this one I thought I would test myself even more. Nuked outs are pretty hard to get but I thought I'd try and get one on PS4. And I say test myself a bit more because I'm obviously more used to playing on the Xbox One. So I thought trying to get it with a different controller would be a challenge. But we've managed and I'm pretty pleased with this gameplay. I think it's pretty exciting. You can't go too hectic getting a nuked out. If you start jumping around all over the map you're probably going to get killed. And that's not the thing to do if you're trying to get 30 kills in a row, gun kills that is, without dying. Or kills from your specialist weapon, of course the score streaks don't help you in these. But anyway, I'm pretty proud of my effort and the gameplay gets pretty intense towards the end. We'll talk about that more as the game reaches its conclusion. But this video is all about me saying a quick thank you um, to everyone that watches my videos and everyone that's subscribed to my channel. It does mean a lot to me. 500 to me is quite a large number of people. It's nothing compared to some people's channels. I guess some people have got millions. Um, but to me 500 is quite a lot and I think quite a lot of people enjoy watching my Black Ops 3 videos. So this is the best sort of way I could think of of saying thank you. And it does mean a lot to me. I enjoy making videos. I always try and make videos that I enjoy and if I'm giving tips, be it on a game or on something to do with a console or whatever, I always try and make videos which I believe are useful. I don't try and just make videos to get views. I always try and make something that's entertaining and if it's tip related then it has to be useful. So that's what I try to do and bring you when I'm making my videos. And I hope that comes across when you watch them. But yeah, 500 subscribers took a little while to get there. I wish I had more time to make more videos. Who knows how things will go in the future. I'd love to be able to make videos every day. Unfortunately, I don't have time at the moment. But I make as much as I can and I hope the ones that I do make you really enjoy. But this Black Ops 3 gameplay, as you can see, it's pretty fast paced. Um, just trying to stay alive and reach that magical 30 number. You can see at the moment I'm 15, 10 up, but things are going to get a bit more scarier as this gameplay goes on. And you'll see it's pretty tense going for a nuked out. Uh, I've got some tip videos actually up on my channel if you're interested in trying to get a nuclear, but same similar sort of things apply but I think in free for all mode the silencer is a bit or the suppressor is a bit more effective than it is going uh, for a nuclear and team based mode. But yeah 500 subscribers again thank you so much for everyone that subscribes, everyone that watches my videos. As I say I make videos that I enjoy and if you enjoy them too then I know you'll subscribe or keep watching them and that means a lot to me. It keeps me motivated to make more. If nobody watched my videos then what on earth would be the point of recording them? I'd be as well just playing the games and doing things without recording but I do enjoy making the videos and I'm really pleased that at least 500 people have liked one or more of my videos and felt that they would like to subscribe. That's pretty cool. There we go, we're on a relentless, we're on a 20 now and we've got a two point lead and now we get a three point lead but the game's going pretty well but these nuked outs are so hard, so are nuclears but I think arguably nuked outs are maybe the most difficult thing to get in the game. I perhaps feel that nuclear can be as hard or uh, almost harder because in this game mode anything you see or hear you know is an enemy but when you're playing team based mode you can't really rely on that. Anyway, if you look now at the score, I have fallen one behind. 
and I notice I'm two off getting another hater in so we're, we're tied now 22 all and I'm really desperate just to get another couple of kills um, to get my hater active because that really helps a lot but the I notice this is like a small tip for you here but the hater is not like instant so there can be a slight delay so Positions on the map of an enemy are not quite what the, they are in the game. The, the enemy in the game could be like a, a few meters away, but as you can see there, there's a counter uh, UAV up as well, and I've fallen two behind. So at this point, things are getting pretty tense. I'm now three behind. I'm watching the time. I've got plenty of time, but I'm very concerned about these three kills behind that I am. So there we go, to play a bit more aggressive, move more in the middle of the map where I thought there would be enemies, get the hater, now I can see where they are, but of course, as I say, there's a slight delay in the hater and I can see enemies all around me, but I'm trying to say which ones do I go for, and I chase that guy, he's running off, and look at this score, I'm four behind, three behind now, but that guy just needs two kills, I mean he could get two kills in a second and that's game over for me. Look at it now, he's, he only needs one more. One more kill, I am like, at this point I'm thinking, oh no, what's going to happen? Where are these enemies? Luckily my hater is still up, it's really helping me a lot. But um, the score is so much against me. I'm now only one behind him, but I still need two kills. Take out that guy who's using the scythe, that could have been game over right there. 29 all, it's very nervous at this point. I can see a guy on my mini-map up here. And then he comes round, I'm just thinking, please don't shoot me as <laughs> you come round, and there we go, we get it. So, 30 kills, uh, gun kills for me, my specialist did not help me get any kills, I had uh, kinetic armour on in this one. But uh, yeah, 30 gun kills in a row against everyone else running wild in the game, they're able to use score streaks and everything, it is a pretty tough test. But I'm pretty pleased, as I say, it's my second uh, nuked out, I've got one on Xbox One and a standard nuclear on Xbox One and then I've got the nuked out here on PS4, but this is my little 500 subscriber video, my thank you video coming to an end. As I say, thanks so much for watching my videos, thanks for subscribing, it means a lot to me, it keeps me interested and I really hope you enjoy them because if people enjoy them or get some benefit out of any informational videos that means a lot to me and it makes it all worthwhile. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you soon for more videos.